Hello, my name is Alan Silberberg, and I'm the author of Meet the Latkes and the new Meet the Matzah. I also draw the pictures. And when I tell kids about my books, I love to show them some easy ways to draw some of the characters from my books. So I have to share my screen. And let's start learning how to draw matzah. Now, in my book, Meet the Matzah, which is a Passover story, the main character is, you guessed it, a piece of matzah. And his name is Alfie Komen. So here's how you draw a piece of matzah. You just start off with a simple shape. And by a simple shape, I mean something that you already know how to draw. Trust me, you know how to draw something that looks like, and it doesn't have to be like a perfect square, but kind of like a square. Now, you start with the square shape, and if you put a circle, and then a second circle, and put some dots in the middle, you get eyes, and then just a smile. And because it's a piece of matzah, if you don't know matzah, matzah has these little like burned marks up and down the middle and the sides. So if you just sort of add a little bit of lines and dots, you'll get the look of matzah. And for legs, I like to teach really simple drawings. So just sticks for legs, and then just a little feet colored in, and arms are the same way. Stick, stick, and then I'll just make really simple hands. And that is how you draw Alfie Komen who's the star of my book, Meet the Matzah. But I have other books. I have Meet the Latkes. Now, Latkes are potato pancakes that we eat and celebrate for the holiday of Hanukkah. And to make one of the characters from my Latke book, it's so easy. If you can make a circle or something that doesn't have to really be a circle, so don't get all worried about making it a perfect circle. If you start with a circle and then put two other circles again, I think you can sense a pattern here of how I draw. And now I'm adding lines that make them into glasses. And I have a character in my book who's very kind of silly, and he's the grandpa, Grandpa Latke. And again, the legs are just little sticks for an arm. And I'll do a little bit fancier hands this time, which are loops, one loop, two loop, three loops. It's really simple. and. Latkes are fried pancakes, so I put these little just circles and dots and squiggles just to give him a little bit of burnt texture because he's a latke. And that's how you draw Grandpa Latke from Meet the Latkes. One more drawing. My next book is called Meet the Hamantaschen. Now, Hamantaschen are pastries that are eaten for the Jewish holiday of Purim. So, to draw a Hamantaschen for my next book, it's another simple shape you already know. I believe it. Start with something that looks sort of like a triangle. It doesn't have to be perfect. Something that has the three sides. Now, in my book next year, the Hamantaschen are going to be detectives. So to start off with this Hamantaschen, we're going to put a line right through the top and then add the letter M and color that in. and. By adding a letter M and a line, you've made a hat. Again, you have two circle eyes and two dots for eyeballs. Now, Hamantaschen have that pocket. So I start with just three more lines. And inside here is where all the yummy stuff goes. And then just a line for the smile or the funny face. And because this detective is very stern, we'll give him eyebrows by just putting lines over the eyes. You know what I'm going to tell you about legs. Boom, boom, simple lines and simple feet. And this, if you start with a V on its side, on both sides, and put the sticks there for the hands, you're showing a different pose, which is this Hamantaschen with his hands on his hips. So that is the simple, easy drawing lessons that I wanted to give you 
today. I hope you have a great Passover, and I hope you enjoy doodling. Thanks, everybody. Bye.